you know, you hear a lot about the rapture and people wonder, have I missed it? Can I miss it? Well, the reality is nobody's going to miss the rapture, at least not the Bible rapture. Actually, the word rapture is not found in the Bible, but you do find in 1 Thessalonians 4, where people go to teach a doctrine that deals with the snatching away, the parousia, whatever they want to call it. But it's far from what you oftentimes hear taught. In the book of 1 Thessalonians 4, there were those who had been taught. They missed the rapture, the resurrection. But he says, I would not have you to be ignorant, brethren, concerning them which are asleep, which you saw or not, even as others which have no hope. If we believe that Jesus died and rose again, even so those which sleep in Jesus will God bring with him. For this we say unto you by the word of the Lord, that we which are alive and remain to the coming of the Lord shall not prevent those which are asleep. The Lord himself shall descend from heaven with a shout, with the voice of the archangel, with the trump of God, and the dead in Christ shall rise first. Then we which are alive and remain shall be caught up together with him in the clouds to, to meet the Lord in the air. So shall we ever be with the Lord. Wherefore, comfort one another with these words. Well, people teach a fantastic doctrine of Jesus coming back, starting a time of tribulation, and about to establish his kingdom. And, you know, we've discussed some of those things before, but the fact is, this passage doesn't teach anything about that. coming. In fact, it tells us that whenever he comes, it's going to be with a shout, the voice of the archangel, the trump of God. You know, that coincides with what we find in Revelation 1 and verse 7, that whenever he returns, every eye shall see him. And it's not going to be just a select people that are taken. Now, he's talking to the saved here, assuring them that they will, as those who have died in the Lord, will go to be with him. But you find in the book of John, the sixth chapter, or rather the fifth chapter, that whenever Christ comes again, in John, the fifth chapter, we find there that we are told that, marvel not at this, the hour cometh in which all that are in the grave shall hear his voice and shall come forth. They that have done good under the resurrection of life, they that have done evil under the resurrection of damnation. You see, there's going to be one resurrection. The word rapture isn't found in the Bible, but First Thessalonians uh, speaks of the resurrection. And we ought to prepare for that. The time will come in which we don't know when it will be. Thus we prepare by being in Christ. Those who die in the Lord, we, we find that we are in Christ whenever, Galatians 3, 26 and 27, we're baptized into Christ. Live faithfully, die faithful. The rapture, no, the resurrection will come, and we can have comfort in that. I pray that you do that. I pray that all of us prepare for the coming of the Lord. If we can help you with this or any other things, just Contact us, and we'll be glad to help you answer any questions you might have.